so uh, where to start so my name's Shauna in case you didn't know um and today I'm just gonna go over some things that are happening in my life because why the heck not um so this is gonna be pretty short probably um so yeah let's get started um, the first thing I want to bring up is my birthday is November 3rd, which is actually pretty close. I mean, for me it's close. It might not seem that close to you, but for me who's been counting down since May 3rd, my half birthday, until I get to my current birthday when I'm turning 16, I can get my license. It's decently exciting enough. Um, yeah. Um, Al, who you might know from Caden is cools video that was an interruption caused by apple's lack of ability to give us the full storage that we ordered on phones i ordered 64 gigabytes and you're only letting me use like 50. pleasant um so what i was saying is al um is turning 16 too in november a few days after my birthday so pretty cool um uh, so my mom is a teacher. I don't think I've told you guys this. She's a teacher. She works at the local elementary school. And literally, they follow my mom home. Okay, one just came to the door and asked me for money because it's like this fun run or whatever where they're like running to raise money for the school. Yeah, I felt bad not giving her money, so I realized I had to. I ran upstairs, tried to find money, and all I could find was money that I'm saving for when I go to Europe, which will be next summer. So, lost some money for that trip to give to a little girl. Sort of annoying. And then they come to the door expecting to find my mom, and I'm like, hey, I'm a person too. My mom isn't the only one that lives here. Um, other things are going on. School sucks, yeah. I'm jealous of you guys who are, are out of high school. College sounds actually really fun. Um, I'm doing early college next year, so that should be fun. I'm switching to online school, hopefully end of January, which is the end of the term. Mm. Oh, and exciting news. I don't think I mentioned this on here. I mean, you guys probably know I'm a big fan of Tyler Oakley, especially if you follow my Twitter. Tyler Oakley liked two of my tweets, and I am literally dead inside. And one of them was about, I asked him if I could be person of the week, and like, he liked it, so I'm hoping that maybe I will, I will be. I don't know. I'll post something about it on my Instagram if that happens. Um... I'm currently doing this spooktacular book challenge thing because I like books, but I should have thought it through before I entered it because it's wanting us to post like pictures of scary books, paranormal books. The scariest book I've read is Hush Hush, and that isn't even scary in general, it's just a little paranormal romance, so yeah, and I don't even own that, so... Um, yeah, and I just want to say I'm proud of everyone who came out on National Coming Out Day, and I'm proud of everybody who opened up about their mental disorders on the mental illness day, which was this week too, I think. Yeah. Um, I was really moved by those. Now, I'm not going to come out and say if I have any mental disorders or what my sexuality is, but just know that I'm very supportive of everyone, and I'm here for you guys if you need me. You can message me on Instagram, or Twitter, or whatever you want if you're feeling feel a little down and I'll respond to you. And the only reason why I'm crying is because I'm so, so tired. I got enough sleep, but I don't know. I have a caffeine addiction now, but honestly, it doesn't help. I still fall asleep in class. So yeah, that's basically everything that's going on in my life. 
nothing much. I mean, I'm going to LeakyCon, that's pretty exciting. I've mentioned this so many times, but who cares? I'm excited, that has to count for something. And, yep, that's all I have, so hope you guys are doing great, and feel free to come to me with questions, or you just need to rant about something, feel free to come to me. Love y'all. Bye.